Hi, I'm Steve Blake. I'm the Solutions Consultant for Access Control and ID Systems here at AIT. I've been in the security industry and advising people for about 15 years now and today I'd like to talk to you specifically about how access control can work in the education sector. So it might seem a little bit tricky at first but actually it's very very simple. Um, a lot of uh, users at the moment have simple locks and, and keys. Uh, and that's fine, um, but you might need to step back from that and look at what a modern access control system can do for you. Um, locks and keys actually can be more expensive than you think in the first instance, especially if, as a lot of places do now, you, you have suited sets of locks. If somebody loses a key or somebody leaves uh, their employment and takes a key with them, changing suited locks can be very expensive. Um, it's also a major pain in the backside continuously having to get keys cut uh, and secure key cutting is, is uh, again an expensive thing to do. With an access control system, uh, if you have uh, users with whether it be ID cards or maybe bracelets or fobs, whatever it is, if somebody loses that token that allows them to get in and out, uh, then it can be blocked from the system very, very quickly. You haven't got to change a whole system as you otherwise would do. You also get the ability to give both staff and students access to the areas that you want them to have access to. Um, so, providing someone's got the right access, they can get through all the doors. Um, if they haven't got the right access, obviously, they can't do. That means you get no more Year 7s in the sixth form block. Big advantage. Um, the other thing that you obviously gain from access control is stopping any unauthorised access at any point. Um, and we all know in, in the modern era what were the requirements of safeguarding, general health and safety legislation and the overall security of staff, pupils and anyone else that works on the premises is paramount. So the ability to lock something as a perimeter and stop anyone getting in that isn't allowed to is a big advantage and not something that you can generally do with a lock and key. It tends to be something that's very physical. So therefore, once you've locked a door in the morning, it's locked. You have to have it open to let everyone in. Therefore, you need someone manning it. All those things are taken out completely with an access control situation. The other thing that you can do is, is the add-ons that come with using a modern system. So you can monitor attendance. Um, uh, the system that we use, for instance, is System by Salto, um, and you can get audit reports from that system of various different types. Um, we can help you to specify what your reports are and the frequency and what they show. There have been um, some very unfortunate incidences within the education sector and I certainly don't want to play on it but it's something that anyone in the sector is aware of in any case. It does highlight the need for uh, a, a thought specifically about the security of all of those people and I'm very conscious, I'm sure you're very conscious that other people's children become your responsibility when they're on your site so that aspect is key. One of the things that can affect your Ofsted scores are security issues, health and safety issues, and as we mentioned, safeguarding specifically. If you have a really good access control system and it's been set up correctly, um, whether it be us or always take advice from the people that are going to put it in, you know, real experts will help you to come up with the right system that works for you. Um, and one of the big advantages with a, a system like the Salto uh, is that it allows integration with other things that you may have on site. So if you have a, a cashless catering system, something that allows for the free school meals, access control can integrate that through the ID card that the student carries. Um, you can allow room or sports facility booking in larger, or higher, further education facilities. Um, it can tie in with library systems. Pretty much anything that works with uh, a, an SQL database or some form of database that can transfer between. So your HR systems, your business information systems, the school information systems, 
can all be pulled together so you've got a single point. And that means that if somebody leaves, if somebody is expelled, that scenario, um, one point of contact for yourselves can block them from all those systems. Overall, uh, a modern access control system can be nice and simple, um, it should be cost effective, and obviously it needs to be tailored exactly to your requirements. So, there are lots and lots of options, but people like us, especially me, we're here to advise you. Um, so if you're interested, then please give us a call, um, either 0113 273 0300, or drop us an email at solutions at AIT.co.uk. Thanks very much.